Hey there friends, thanks for checking in at the range now and today we're looking at my Star BM9. Very similar to a Browning High Power. I consider this to a degree a high power subcompact. Now it does have a four inch barrel, all steel frame, a single action trigger with an eight round magazine that does have a magazine disconnect but it mimics many of the features of the high power. What makes this ultra attractive is how much it was selling for. It was around 230 bucks. And I'm impressed with it and I've been impressed with it. Now it does have a five pound trigger, uh, obviously single action only, it does have a thump safety right there that is engaged because I have a round in the chamber, but it also has a magazine disconnect, which does not allow me to fire that round. The thump safety, is already engaged but it's meant to be carried cocked and locked so a total of nine rounds blacked out sights all across but i have found it to be accurate and reliable for an incredible price that many people were picking this up for and i've i've seen it even around 200 dollars. now this is a military surplus gun it was in the hands of law enforcement and military and it's a made in Spain. So in Spain, no civilians use it. And this was made in 79. So let me stop yapping here. We'll take a few shots and see how I do with this Star BM9. Yeah, just as I remember it. Impressive gun for the money. And even if it was more money, it would still be an impressive handgun. Now, when I first got it, I didn't know the year that it was produced, but it, it stamped right there on the trigger guard, right on the top side. There it says 79. So this was actually made in 79. This one is in excellent condition. It really is. You look at some of them, there's a lot of slide wear, uh, you know, chips and scratches throughout this one not so much so i'm really happy to have it another thing that makes it similar to the high power is the disassemble it disassembles the exact same way and it does have an all steel guide rod and a captured recoil spring along with the magazine disconnect that i don't find too attractive but that does mimic the high power so let me go ahead and we'll try some one-handed shooting here And that's it. These were typically coming with one mag, but being that it's a surplus gun, it is out there. It's a good looking gun, or I shall say, I should say mags are out there from what I could tell. Single stack, nine millimeter handgun, the Star BM9. Has a barrel bushing there that needs to be disassembled. I'm not gonna take the gun down entirely. But I will show you once you dis or once you engage the thumb safety, the pin just drops out, and then you take it off, and you can see what you're looking at. Does have a link like a 1911 and the four-inch barrel. Let me take a few shots and then I will turn the camera around. I'm using cheap reloads that I picked up oh, probably a year ago. So we'll see how it's It looks like I have a double feed. So I'll lock the slide back. And I will let that round or case drop out. And I'll go ahead and turn the camera around. Picked up a Explorer recently, 2015 Explorer. I'm not big on buying new vehicles. I Disengaged the thumb safety. Let's see how it goes. And I have another double feed. We're going to try this again with some factory ammo that I, that I have. Get out of there. I have, I have one round left. 
But now I have Fiocchi 115 grain ball ammo. Whoa, boy. So maybe it wasn't the rounds that I had. There goes one out of the mag. That's okay. Huh? Thumb safety. Here we go. All right, so I have a little issue here. I was talking about how much I enjoy the star, and I do. But I need to clean it up because right now it is not ejecting properly. On. We'll try it one more time. See what's going on here. All right. So <laughs> there it is. My Star BM9 made in 1979. I do enjoy it, I have to say. Probably needs a good bath. And I'll have this out again and see if it can perform a little better. But it has not experienced, or I have not experienced any issues until today. Go figure, you turn the camera on and this is what happened. But it's real and I still love the gun. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.